a fun way to take down two slices of pizza, you fold it. <laughs> Bulkin tips. Very simple day today. Um, as you guys know, with the whole bulking stuff, I'm going to be taking Sunday as like a day off and just pretty much a full day of eating. So yeah, today's a, so today's a full day of eating, boys. We gotta start off, um, how do I do this? Get some Prime, we'll add the calories on there. This is apparently 25 calories. We gotta get our medications in, or our, our vitamins. If you're wondering what we got on the menu, um, here's what we have. We got some, some pizza. We also got some, uh, some, this is a, this is like a taco in a bowl. Not the most healthiest meal, but for the bulk, sometimes you gotta sacrifice it a little bit. Taco meat. Cheese, sour cream, chips, all that. Yeah, yeah, taco, chips, cheese, sour cream. That's it. <laughs> That's it. And we also got some string cheese, so. Actually, before this, I actually want to weigh myself. Let me uh, give you guys a quick update. Uh-oh, that's a little concerning. We're at 143, 142 right now. It's kind of hovering in that area, so. Didn't have anything in my system, so, uh, yeah. No excuses. One week into this. Kind of a weak week. Uh, trust me, trust me. Next week it'll definitely be a much better week. Fun little meal we got here, am I right? Watching some WWE right now while I'm eating. Come on, man. It's too good. Way too good. If you guys are lifting right now and stuff, are you guys in the bulk or are you guys in the cut? I guess logically people would be starting to cut right now. I guess they want to get ready for the for the summer, you know? In the Aldwin channel, we do, we do things a little differently here. We start the bulk right before summer. This is technically the first meal of the day. Both of these are the first meals. My second meal is gonna be like right after this, the, the smoothie. And then I'm gonna have a nice little dinner. I'm not gonna lie, it's a bit sad that I didn't really grow much. Trust in the process. It's only a week into this. Trust me, I will hit that 160 mark. Trust me on that. I don't know if you guys see this. You remember in the 2020 Royal Rumble when Edge returned? It was sick. The most important day of the bulk is the full day of eating where you just do nothing but eat it's nice not only because you're eating food but it also gives you a break from from lifting nothing to worry about besides just fattening up it's great a fun way to take down two slices of pizza you fold it <laughs> bulking tips Jesus, it is 10 p.m. right now. So I was kind of figuring out what the calorie was, um, or how much the calories I was consuming in the last meal. I guess I was kind of totaling it up to... Okay, so let me break this down. Two slices of pizza that I had, uh, I looked at the calories, and it said a fourth of a pizza is 410 calories, and that equates to two slices. 400 calories, great. I looked at the Doritos, and I say, I'd say I had like about 20 chips, 20, 24 chips, and apparently 12 things of uh, Doritos is 150 calories, so. so the pizza alone is 400, and then the chips is about 300, because that's how much chips I had in the bowl, so that's at least 700 calories. I think with everything else that I had in there, with the sour cream, the cheese, and also, you know, the liquid cheese and the ground beef, that, I'd say that equates to about 1,000, maybe 1,100. I can't hit on it. I mean, hey, I got a good amount of food in there. I'm gonna have this meal, and this isn't the only meal I'm gonna have. Uh, so what I have is bitter, bitter melon or what we call in the Philippines, amparaya. And I got a little bit of meatballs that I had left over, so I just kind of popped it on top of that to microwave it with it. This isn't the last meal. The last meal is going to be the, the protein shake. At the end of the day, calories is king. So right now, I'm only really counting calories. I'm not really counting, you know, fats, carbohydrates, whatever, protein. With all the stuff that I eat, I know for a fact I get enough protein. I'll probably have a... Screw it, let's have one. Yeah, one of these. And on top of that, we also got... Some creatine monohydrate. The last time I dry scooped this was a long time ago, so you don't want to dry scoop this stuff, all right? This is only for the one time. I, I won't do it again. I was actually gonna put my creatine in the protein shake. Never mind. But oh well, we got it done anyway. I don't know. Maybe I started off this bulk stuff with 140. Maybe not 142, but we'll still say 142 anyway. The weigh-in that I had this morning could potentially show the sign of like how hard this whole bulk's gonna be. This might not be as easy as I thought. This is what my mom made. This isn't like, this isn't just bitter apple. This also has ham. This also has uh, eggs. It's hard to even imagine how much like energy my body is like releasing because it's not just lifting anymore, you know? Definitely need some more nutrients, ladies and gentlemen. I took a nap prior to this, mainly because I'm like kind of sick. Good thing I had some medication last night because otherwise I'd be getting the full sickness experience right now. At the moment, we're just kind of like recovering which is great. Definitely could be better though. You know what I mean? I actually had a couple plans 
today. I was gonna go shop for some more vitamins, protein powder. I had a couple things on my list. But yeah, I was planning to go to the store, but I figured I just want to stay inside just so, I'm, just so I'm not infecting anyone else or potentially making my sickness worse. Because it turns out now I have work tomorrow. We're taking this day as like a recovery day. I don't know why I always get sick, bro. Can I have like a weekend where I'm not sick? Definitely gonna have to shop though. Probably tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be one of those days where I'm going to be just taking you guys through my day. Probably just some other boring uh, vlog day. I'm starting to run low on this, actually. Jeez. Depending on how Sunday goes next Sunday, if I don't gain much weight by next week, if I don't get to, like, let's say, because the scale was kind of weird, it was kind of fluctuating from, like, it was kind of in and out of 142, 143. If I don't get to, like, 145 by next Sunday, I'm going to completely reevaluate how much, like, calories I need. I think last year I was aiming for about, like, a... 2.3k calories a day for my bulk, I guess. This time might have to be way more than that. I might meal prep next week. Who knows? I'd say on a scale of 1 to 10, I already feel like 7, 8 out of 10 full. This is gonna put me at a solid 13. With this specific uh, vegan protein, it's so dusty. It feels like I'm like making concrete. You know what I mean? As a Filipino, I know a thing or two about how to make concrete. And this is exactly what it feels like. I should get a clip of me making concrete in the Philippines. It's kind of a cool thing to do, I guess. With the whole construction stuff that we've been doing at the house uh, over at the Philippines, I've always wanted to, like, help out a little bit, you know what I mean? But I've always been told not to help. Just like... Come on, bro. W will this... Will this help out? <laughs> to be fair, I guess I wasn't, like... I was kind of a skinny boy back then. Bulking season is so goddamn tough. I have to eat until I've had eaten. Bulking season is so fucking tough. I have to eat until I've had enough. I've been just working on like the flow. No. For some reason, I've been perfecting the G a lot. So I just need to work on that transition, like to switch really quickly. Sounds good though. Definitely making progress. Anyway, I'm just stalling at this point. I'm gonna be full. I'm gonna get the shivers. Here we go. This one specifically is probably about like 900 calories or 950. There's a lot more milk on this one. Third bathroom break. Jesus. I feel... Uh, <coughs> I should not have laid down. That was a bad idea. I need to edit this video now. Oh god. That has been a full day of eating. I'm tired.